Hello, my name is Mr. Callagy, and I am the Supervisor of Technology for the Wee Open School District. Today, I'm going to read a St. Patrick's Day story called The Luckiest St. Patrick's Day Ever by Teddy Slater with illustrations by Ethan Long. Top of the morning, it's March 17. The Leprechaun family is wearing green. St. Patrick's Parade is about to begin. The wee ones are marching. Come on, let's join in. There goes Bedelia leading the clan, arm in arm with Granddaddy Dan. She swings her shillelagh. They walk and talk gaily, moving as fast as they can. Timothy Shaughnessy, handsome and bold, marches along with a big pot of gold. And here comes Aunt Rose, tap-tapping her toes. With shamrocks in hand, she follows the band, decked out in her very best clothes. toodle dee toot rum a tum tum Johnny and Jack play the fife and the drum. They kick up their heels in a wild Irish jig. Everyone's dancing, even the pig. After the march, it's back home for lunch. Mulligan stew and green apple punch. Kate cuts the cabbage. Pat shelves the peas. The mischievous children do just as they please. Friends and family keep coming to call. There's plenty of food for one and for all. The Casey's, McGregor's, O'Grady's, Peg Finn. Everyone's welcome. Please, won't you come in? Lassies and laddies stream to the door until there's no room for one call or more. The leprechaun crowd round the dining room table, piling their plates as high as they're able. Before they dig in, they have one thing to say. May the luck of the Irish be with you today. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Have a great day, everybody.